Hello, everybody. Hello, Professor. How are you doing? Good, Professor. How are you? <laughs> Great. Good. So, what's going on? Uh, yes, Professor. We tried actually that change password thing. Looking good at it. Uh, you have done it for the change of password. Yes, Professor. Yes. It was it was little bit easy, right? Because it did not involve so many components. Ah, uh, yes, yes, Professor. We And... didn't rewrite the code. That's it. <laughs> right. Right. Okay. So, would you mind showing it to me? Yes, professor. Uh, host is disabled. Uh, professor, host is disabled. Oh, okay, okay. Let me just do it. It is gone. Uh, is it visible, professor? Yeah, I can see. Just a minute. Let me admit some people. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Is this saying something? Added a change password. So, question here is that once look, 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 look. Yeah. There, there's, there's one thing. Why three fields? Why three passwords? Uh. So one is the pin. Yeah, no. it's a current password and new password and the retype the new password. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, okay, good. And, and what about the email? Fixed. Why would you need to have an email? Yes, professor. I tried uh, with the session uh, email. It is not taking up. That's why I confused and uh, added. Email. Okay, okay. Let me see right. that how. Okay, I appreciate yeah. that you did it like this. Yes. And uh, it is actually working. Is it? Uh, yes, professor. It is working right now. Okay, very good. I appreciate that. Okay, just give me a minute. Yes, sir. Okay. Change password. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. I entered the wrong password. Password is changed, and user will be kicked out of the session. Very good. Okay, give me a minute. Yes, uh, Dinesh, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, okay, you can stop sharing actually. Yes. Sir. And I'm happy that you did it. Let me ask Avinash. Did he do it? Avinash, did you do it? Yes, professor. Okay, please share your screen with me. Uh, I have included the email, old password, and the new password. Things. Okay, so okay, what about this thing that you know? Why would you need to have email over here? So change. Uh, two way, uh, oh, two, one more thing. Two. One more thing. You are making this change for password thing at the wrong place. I have included in from uh, inside and outside both the things. No, but look, once you are here, right? So you are like signed out currently. And, yes. Uh, in the sign out position, if you can change your password, right? Anybody can come and change your password. Sign out position. Yeah, it should be done in sign out. You know, when so, you are signed in. You can just stop the video. Yes, please. This is a sign in friend. Uh, I I can show you one second. Give me a second. Okay. Okay. Do we have uh, Menton? And I have included over here too. Okay. Okay. So this is the right place, actually. Yeah. So, but why would you have email address over here? And uh, for retrieving from the database, I'm using the email. Uh, no, but the... Email, you know, once you are signed in, system already knows that what email you are talking about. But I tr I tried for the session email, but it is not coming, sir, professor. That's why I included okay. this thing. Okay. Let me see if somebody has done it, and then I will lecture on it. Okay. So good. Okay, let me have you over here. Let me mark with me. Okay, and uh, what about Menthon? Menthon, have you done it? Yeah, yes. Sir. Okay, did. please stop share and let Menthon share. Thank you. Yeah. Just a minute. Sir. Yeah, please take your time. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. So show yes, me the interface yes. first. Show me the interface. Okay. 
ओके इंटरफेस आई मीन ब्राउजर व्यू ओके एक्चुअली आई हैव टू स्टार्ट द सर्वर सर ओके प्लीज डू इट ओके ओके या या टू साइन इन ओके या साइन इन एंड या चेंज पासवर्ड ओके ओके गुड सो नाउ यू आर नॉट गिविंग द ईमेल एड्रेस राइट नो आई सेड द ईमेल एड्रेस व्हेन आई साइन इन इन द सेशन आई Yeah, you're right. So let me come back to your code. Like, just sign yeah. out, and I will, uh, you know, explore your code with the rest of the okay, class. Okay, sir. Yeah. Okay, just give me a minute. And uh, Shriyash, Shriyash, did you do it? Shriyash, you need to unmute yourself to talk to me. Hi, sir. Yes. So, did you do it, my dear? Ah, uh, yes, sir. Let me see. Here yeah, it is. Ah, uh, I already signing. Uh, should I sign out? Okay. So, so one I... sign out. Okay. Yeah, I. Hi, we are here and back. Sign back in. Okay. Very good. You are. How you are getting the email address? Ah, uh, we are using a session. Session. Very good. Very good. Great. Yeah. This is the right way. Okay. so let me explore your code later on so let me ask uh, uh ankit rao okay ankit have you done it yes sir so how did you do it you are using email or session email a session session i'm using sir okay very good very good excellent so, so this is the interface quite a few people actually got it that how to get it from session okay let me explore your code you know and let me ask uh, uh arun teja yes sir i have done that should i stop share yes please yeah arun teja you can share and show me your uh, gui sir okay this is my mail id password 123456 right okay so you are not using session email right i tried using it sir but uh, okay no problem no problem just sign out just uh, stop sharing and let me ask ankit to share his code and let's see how is he using session email address ankit ankit please share ankit ankit is not here probably he got dropped out so i would ask menthan to share okay so show us from the sign in part right so once you get signed in so where is the sign in procedure okay so here is a sign in in the top yes so, so i said the session in so line number 31 yeah right so basically he is saving session email okay so instead of sa saving the entire user you are just saving the email session here yeah. right okay yeah. this is one way this is this is a, a intelligent step he has taken the mm -hmm. other way could have been that once you have got the result you can actually stringify the result and save the entire result entire into uh, into yeah. the session that that is also possible right first name last name yeah entire user in the session you can you can use, save the entire user data into the session right so you yeah, can we can also. yeah so and, but, and once you want to change yeah. the password so take us to the change change password function yeah so change password here So okay. I just check my session is sign in. So okay. uh, uh, if I sign in, then only I can change the password. Right. Very good. 
so you are new user email password I just set email and password, not the first name. Right, right. Okay, and and you are calling that update in DB. In DB, yes, the same function. No. Uh, okay, yeah. yeah. So can you see the uh, uh, Dinesh? Yes, professor. Have you got the idea? Yes, professor. He's saving uh, while signing in. He's saving the post email with the session email, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, I also done the same thing, Professor, but it's showing us email is not good uh, error as, as, as an exception. That's why I wonder oh. what, what I'm doing wrong. Uh, maybe spellings are wrong? Uh, maybe that's what I'm checking now, Professor. Yes, maybe spellings are wrong. Yeah, the same thing I did. I, I saved the email uh, while signing in with okay. the session, with underscore session email, uh, but it's not getting action. Okay, so today I have a classwork for you. Right, and you have to do it in today's session only. And this is the classroom. Okay. Yeah, sir, Ankit, uh, Ankit messaged me that uh, he he has an internet issue uh, in that area. There are they heavily rain. Okay, okay, no problem. Ask him to use his cell phone hotspot to connect. Okay. Right. So because many times it happens to me also, and I use my cell phone hotspot. Okay. Okay, so I was thinking that maybe Ankit will join us so that I can tell you the classwork. So, uh, who is sharing the screen with me? Me, sir. Mantha. Okay. Uh, can you open a browser window? Sure. New tab. Okay. And here go to pick a face and okay. nick.com. Go to me tab on the right side. And okay. here enter the email. DRZ. Oh, sorry. DR. DRZ. ZEB. Okay. At machomet.com. So, look, currently this is me, right? It, it is saying yeah. this tab is saying me, right? Can you see this? Right. Thing? Yes. Password is one, two, three. Sign in. Right? Now you can yeah. see that instead of me, it is having four characters of the name. Yeah, can you see yeah. this thing? Yes, yeah. Right. Don't don't worry about this face, you know, which is being shown alongside it. Right. But I want you guys to change your nav bar in such a way that as you sign in, this me get replaced by this me get replaced by username. Username. First three or four characters of the username and then dot, dot, dot. Please do it now. I want to see okay. it done today. Okay, sir. Within this class. So, okay. Can I stop now, sir? Oh, so just, a, just a minute. Let me ask okay, everybody. Okay. That has everybody got it now? I kind of having a little low voice from you. Could you please repeat it again? I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, sure. No problem, my dear. Menthon, would you please show us this again? Yes, sir. Sorry. So look, uh, let me have Ankit. I'm happy that he got us, you know. Hey Ankit, I'm welcome sorry, back. Sir. No problem, no problem, it happens to all of us. So the deal is, uh, can you please sign, sign back out? Yeah. Okay, from the beginning. So currently you see that the rightmost tab in the navigation bar is me, right? It is saying me, right? Right over here. Can you can you point to it? Yes, sir. Yeah. yeah, this, this one. one. Right? So, so this one, it's rightmost is saying me. As I sign in, so sign in. So you can see that this me got replaced by the username. This one. 
right? So I want you to create this functionality in your CMS. Okay, and this is something you have to do now in the class. I want to check it today. Okay. So please do it if there is any doubt. Arun Teja, do you have any doubt, my dear? No, sir. I got you, sir. Okay. Anybody having any doubt about it? Okay. Great. If there is no doubt, please do it now. Start it. Okay. Uh, can I stop, sir? Yeah, you can stop, sir. Okay. Okay. Uh, can you see my screen now? Okay, let me just go over here. Okay, tomorrow don't miss this last class, right? Tomorrow I'm going to have an evaluation and I will let you know your grades, okay? So don't miss tomorrow's class, okay? Hello, everybody. Yes, sir. Okay, good. Okay, so where is my nav? Uh, layouts. And this is me, where I did the sign-in process. Where is sign-in process? Yeah, here is the sign in process. Mm. So here you are logging in, right? And I am putting uh, the results in. No, this is my session. Sign in result sub zero, right? So let's see what's happening in this function sign in result sub zero, right? Sign in result sub zero. So let's refresh this thing. So we go to includes and here in the session file, uh, sign in, right? Sign in process. Uh, where is the sign in process? This is a sign in process, right? So basically user attributes are big, being given to the session, right? Session user attribute, right? So let me do one thing, copy, right? And uh, copy this thing. And where is the page? Uh, and it goes to my wall, right? So let me go to my wall. Where is my wall? Right. So this is my wall, right? So this is this is my wall where we are redirecting. Uh, are we? So yes. Otherwise, right? So basically it's not sign in. So we come over here and right at the top, right at the top after we have got this, these head in, this head included. So we come on the top and we here say PHP. And we echo, we say if, is set, so just want to show you, this is not part of the code we are going to write. This is just, you know, uh, for the purpose of demo, right? We are going to remove this code later on. So if it is set, then echo, 
and this is exactly how we code. And let me bar dump. <laughs> okay, great. So let me come over here where our file is open. And let's have sign in. Okay, so basically, let me sign back in. Um, okay, look. So, whatever I have done, look, this session has all this information. It has the name, right? It has the first name, it has the last name you want to have first name you want to have last name whatever you want to have you can get it there can you see i just simply word dump it and it is everything is right now over here in session so all i have to do is to access it from the session and display it in the nav bar so it should not have been difficult right so i come over here in the nav bar nav bar would probably be in layouts so I go to my nav bar and look, this last tag, right? So let's cut it. And I say, right over here, if dollar my session right dollar my session sub is sign in if it is sign in then do what then dollar html dot equal to I don't know how uh, rest of the people has done, but this is the most logical way. Dot equal to this tag, right? And then not this tag with me dot PHP over here. So one thing is that there should be single quotes. Rather, right over here, I would have dollar underscore session. I think sub. it was the link. Uh, oh, it's not. Say it again. Uh, it was a link of the file. Uh, the, uh, it is it, it, it not a name. Actually, we put the uh, we have to put the session into me in. Oh, okay. You are right. Me. Yes, yes, yeah. you are right. Thank you, thank you. I look, there are so many good people sitting here. So it should have been here, very good. Yeah. Excellent, I appreciate. So here we have to say dollar underscore session. And I'm very happy that you know I was able to uh, teach you uh, how to code. At least, you know, a few people know how to code now. Good, okay dollar underscore session and what is the what is that so let me take you to me.php and it is no not not this one this is that bar uh where my wall right i ha i had it at my wall where is my wall so my wall right so here's uh what did i put session user attributes right so user attributes so session user attribute. User 
attributes sub first name right else dollar html dot equal to this tag simple simple php 2 minutes php and i think it should work without any issue okay so let me let me check it so we have saved it let's go back to the browser and reload can you see that we have got the first name over here if we go over here sign out we got this me right if we come over here sign in sign in it is sort of right so just remove this code now which was just placed for testing purposes right guys so i'm just commenting it not deleting it right guys so that's it that's pretty much it like five minutes task so please pay attention and uh, these tasks should not take so long so what was the issue hello i was unable to get the first name so my dear so analyze it once you are you cannot get it if it is a string just echo it out see what it is what is present inside okay yes, if it is an array just dump it see what is inside it okay once you know once there is a big piece of data and you don't know how to handle it first look into it and see what it is composed of and then you know crack it down okay so tomorrow uh, is this agenda that tomorrow i am going to revert back on uh, uml i will discuss class diagram a little bit more then i will discuss state diagram thereby i will end your course and then i will have us have some evaluation and i will let you know your grades and will say uh, farewell and goodbye to you okay so this is tomorrow's agenda so don't be uh, missing tomorrow's class somebody wants menthan you want to say something i thought you wanted to add something menthan no okay let me send this code to you guys c d o d p summer of 2020 get status you put just uh, dots before and after right ha huh? get a dot get commit minus m uh nav bar further work and get push okay here the code goes to you okay great thank you very much anything else guys so let me stop share and uh, i'm available for my office hours right now if you want to have me for them otherwise you can simply log out and i will see you all tomorrow for the last lecture and have a you know great rest of the day goodbye yeah thank you sir take care
Hello, Professor. Just a minute.